The union cabinet chaired by the Prime Minister of India meets at regular intervals and takes decisions with a focus on giving impetus to India's development across sectors ranging from infrastructure, agriculture, education, rural development to many more. Let's take a quick glance at the significant cabinet decisions taken during January 2023. National Green Hydrogen Mission with an initial outlay of Rs 19,744 crore aims at Development of green hydrogen production capacity of at least 5 MMT, that is million metric ton per annum. Renewable energy capacity addition of about 125 gigawatt. Over rupees 1 lakh crore cumulative reduction in fossil fuel imports. Abatement of nearly 50 MMT of annual greenhouse gas emissions and creation of over 6 lakh jobs. Broadcasting infrastructure and network development scheme with an outlay of Rs 2,539.61 crore up to 2025-26, aims at strengthening of Doordarshan and Akashmani infrastructure and services, widening reach in left-wing extremism, border and strategic areas, providing high-quality content for domestic and international audience, purchase of OB vans and digital upgradation of DD and AIR studios, development of Northeastern region, Cabinet approves a continuation of schemes of Ministry of Development of Northeastern Region till 2025-26 with an outlay of Rs 12,882.2 crore. It will provide gap-filling support to eight northeastern states and will help increase employment opportunities. Union Cabinet approves the incentive scheme for promotion of rupee debit cards and low-value person to merchant Bhim UBI transactions with an outlay of Rs 2,600 crore. It will further promote UPI Lite and UPI 123 Pay as economical and user-friendly digital payment options. Cabinet gives a nod to setting up of three national-level multi-state cooperative societies under MSCS Act 2002. Multi-State Cooperative Organic Society for testing, branding and selling organic products to help farmers sell organic products worldwide. Multi-State Cooperative Seed Society for production, purchase, branding and selling of seeds aimed at protecting indigenous natural seeds. Multi-State Cooperative Export Society to benefit around 8.45 lakh societies, converting them into successful commercial enterprises. The decisions taken are a reflection of the union government's efforts and commitment towards achieving the goal of an Aath Panirbhar Bharat.